they say it can be hot enough to fry an egg. Well, in the UK, we're going through our first sort of heat wave where we're going to try and get over 40 Celsius. So we've got here a frying pan, and I've left it outside, and I've got my trusty infrared thermometer, and I can record the temperature on here. And what we're going to try and do is I've already put a little bit of oil in there and I've got my egg and we're going to try and see if we can fry an egg in this frying pan. Let's have a go. Now our frying pan's at about 120 Celsius. I'm going to put it more in the sun and let's see if we can crack an egg and get it to cook. And you can see it is cooking, it is changing colour. It is still sort of quite white there. I won't say it's cooking terribly fast, but it is going. Apologies to the amount of stuff, egg, that I've managed to miss. But we seem to have an egg cooking, albeit slowly. The sun, it's, it's cooled down a little bit now. It's now only at 90 because we've put on uh, a colder egg onto the frying pan. But gradually that should heat up and we should get a fried egg. I'm going to it along a bit. We've got the shadow of that coming along. That's even bubbling a little bit there. Let's see what happens if we can turn it over. Oh, it looks like it's cooking. It looks like it's sticking a bit as well. There is, of course, only half an egg there because I missed with the rest of the egg. But uh, let's see what's happening again. Well, I think we've got a cooked egg here. So, uh, as long as the pan's hot enough, then it's going to work. And that is just having enough direct sunlight on it to heat it up. And we're lucky that we're enclosed here in a back garden, which will sort of really ramp up the temperature quite a bit. Even the ambient temperature around here is nearly 40 Celsius. So I'm going to declare my egg done. Oh dear. There we are, one egg for you. Mmm. Sunny side up. <laughs>